Hello everyone. Mm. So today I'm, I would like to make a really quick video about all the good things that happened to me on in September the past month. So the first is I want to talk about two apps that I um, find really helpful. First one is called Strides. It's spelled S-T-R-I-D-E-S. -E and it's an uh, um, app that will help you develop good habits. And I, um, so I actually started using this app quite a while ago. And I started put, putting things in there like drinking a little of water when I wake up. And then you, doing yoga, morning yoga, meditation, like drinking two, two bottles of water when I'm at school. And um, yeah, the first thing is uh, always eight hours of sleep and um, a controlled dinner. Like I don't, I don't um, want to eat too much for dinner. And I feel like that has, um, it's really helpful because at the end of the day, you need to like swipe out everything that you have done in the list. And um, a few of the things I feel like I'm, I'm already, uh, it's already becoming a habit that I don't really need to uh, like log in every day. So I have deleted some of them and added more. And um, so it's, I think it's a really great app. And the next app is called um, Pocket Points. I, um, I learned this, this uh, learned about this app from a student that I teach. And um, it's basically like an app that you can put on your phone and whenever you are at school in a in um in a study building any 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 building inside that uh, inside a school and if you don't use your phone during that time you will start to gain points and then you can use the points to like um have coupons like 10 percent 10 percent off buy one get one free like these kind of stuff and i think it will vary depending on the area that you're living in and I, um, yeah, so, so around there, I have checked all of, all of the, like, the vendors that are, that have the coupons, and I found that the, 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 the best one is to have a free medium smoothie from Smoothie King. I, I actually haven't had anything from Smoothie King before, but after I use this app, I have, like, you have to use 80 points to get, um, uh, a free smoothie and it's limited so every uh, start of the week there's only five slots that you have to like grab and then you can have a free smoothie and I actually went there for their vegan smoothie it's pretty good and yeah so you are just you are just getting things free things for doing nothing with your phone and I think these apps are really awesome right you can like um, encourage people to like not check their phone every once in a while and the second thing is a book um, my good friend my good Indian friend has has lent that book to me I think she has brought that book from India and it's called the monk who has sold his Ferrari and I I'm not sure whether it's a really, really popular book, but I, it's, the, it's the first time that I heard about this book. And I read it, it's, um, it's a quick read, and I feel like it's, there are very, um, um, very practical things that I can put into practice every day. And so I have kept a, a note about what I learned in the, in the book, and I think I'll just read to you some of the, yeah, some of the things. So um, uh, they suggested ten rituals that you um, that that you need to do every day. So the first one is ritual of solitude. Um, ensuring daily schedule includes a mandatory period of peace, so um, so that you have time to reflect on what you have done well or what you need to improve on the next day. And yeah, and the next one is ritual of physicality. So you have to have some. Uh, physical activity every day, um, any form of exercise or moving, that is good. And the ritual of life nourishment, that's basically saying that um, like vegetables and fruits, they are good and um, um, probably avoid meat because they're not life nourishment. And ritual of abundant knowledge, and that's about uh, trying to improve every day. Like, you, um, like we need to um, 
continue reading and learning and start and improving ourselves every day, like spend time um, to on ourselves. And then ritual of personal reflection and ritual of early awakening. So it's it's good that we uh, wake up early and also some spend some time in solitude. And ritual of music. So music is very good. Um, yeah, so you can listen to the music and um, find peace. Um, and ritual of words. So um, there are many mantras that you can repeat to yourself, like when you are waiting on the traffic or when you are doing something like washing dishes, you can just repeat the mantra like... Um, um, Yes, I think I have one mantra written down. I am more than I appear to be. All the world's strength and power rest inside me. Yeah, and so you can repeat this hundreds of times, and it will it it will be um, a really uh, good positive effect on your everyday life. And then ritual of congruent character. I think that's about um, you need to be true to yourself. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there are a few things: industry, compassion, humility, patience, honesty, and courage. And the next one is ritual of simplicity. So live simple. Um, we don't need too much. We don't need to buy things to be happy. The yeah, the happiness is inside of us. And so that's the second thing. And the third thing is, I started going to uh, step classes. So. Um, uh, recently, yeah, I haven't been doing any cardio much, um, but I have been attending a training program for group fitness trainer. So after a six-week program, I will like I will audition for the uh, fitness center for our school and see whether I can become an instructor for group fitness. And um, so for that, there are two things that we um, that we um, we are. The new newbies are allowed to teach. The first one is step classes, and another is kickboxing. And since the, the central topic of this week's training is step class, I've been to several step classes. And I, I, I guess I never really went to a step class before, because I think it's kind of like kind of easy and repetitive. But the few classes that I've been to um, this past few weeks, it's kind of really interesting, because. You, uh, you start to know that there are more complicated moves and you can make the choreography very um, interesting and fun and it's also um, good to listen to the music and then feel the pump and it's also a really good cardio and um, so it's one hour class and I have a I love a, one of the instructor there she is like really awesome she, she's want to teach us really complicated moves and then um, trying to have many combo as many combos as possible taught to us and um yeah so the step class i at first i i don't really feel anything for it but right now i i think yeah i really want to teach this type of class and um yeah and that instructor she also teaches spin classes uh, like the cycling classes and she thinks the step class is the best cardio offered in our um, fitness center, so I think that says a lot, and I I'm just really excited to go go on the step. And um, so this past Friday, we just learned how to teach others how to um, how to step, and I think I'm really good at it. So um, we'll see. I think yeah. And the fourth thing is my favorite food favorite food I think it will be almond butter so I bought this almond butter at Sam's Club and it's quite it's quite cheap I think it's, it might be the cheapest that I see in all the markets and it's just really good it only has almond in it and it's really good I can I can put it on everything like not everything only like I, I really want to put it on bread like the the green tea muffin that I make and the chocolate muffin that I make, and the bread that I make, yeah, the, it's good on everything. Almond butter. I think the the thing about nut butter is that they they are just so good. They have 
they are so like when you put it into your mouth it's it's so good and the next thing and the last thing is yoga so I started practicing yoga maybe in August not maybe I started practicing yoga diligently in August so starting from the August the 1st I, I started uh, I practiced yoga every day and I feel like mm, it has made some really good changes um, for example I um, I am the kind of person who, who usually tend to rush or when I'm waiting on somebody I'm just really like I'm I'm stressed and yeah I'm, I'm just like um, uh, I don't know a word but but I, I just get an annoyed or not, not annoyed um, very anxious yes very anxious when I wait for someone but I feel like I um, like this the past week I have been waiting on some, someone to um, go to a yoga class together and we are I think we're already running late but I started to tell, tell myself that it's okay and what what whatever will happen will happen and and there's no like even if I even if I am an, uh, anxious it wouldn't help anything and I feel like these kind of small changes is I am really happy to see these changes mm, and mm, so I think um, um, when I started uh, the practicing yoga just um, um, every not every day six times six to- six times a week uh, there's one off day every week and I yeah I just on the whole I think it's mm, uh, I, I will I start to be more mindful about things um, and I can <laughs> Like many times, like you, you, if you know what I'm talking, you you have the sm- small talks inside you, especially like me when I'm doing experiments. Some of the experiment I don't need to like put too much mental <coughs> effort into it, and then I start to bo- think about all the things and like things about so many years ago or things about what she said to me yesterday, like s- the s- small talks inside the head, and um, yeah, and sometimes I I just you know. I, I just right now I just can realize that there are those small talks and it's okay and mm, yeah I think just realizing that that is not me is already uh, an advance and yeah so those are the five things that happened to me that are really great in September and I hope you enjoy this video and give it a thumbs up well you don't have to but (laughs) um and i'll see you next time bye bye oh and also i got i just got a hundred subscribers which i'm really happy about but i don't know like what should i do to celebrate that um so you can leave a comment below if you have any ideas i was thinking about eating muffins like see how many like i'll just eat however much when I feel full, but, but, every day, right now, every day, I'm just having smoothie bowls every morning, and, yeah, so, um, I'll see you next time, bye-bye.